temperatures. Ready. It's early. Okay, we're leaving. Yeah, grab my mask. Which one do you want? Pandora. We're going on an adventure today. Come with us for today's life in a day. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Today is July 25th. I have to get that on record. Anyway, we're gonna go on a long road trip today. First, we're stopping at our usual coffee shop. I'm put this on just so that. It doesn't look like it's blown out. Movie magic. This is my wife. Yeah. Wife. <laughs> we just recently got married like almost a month ago. A month a month ago oh, wow. well, in five days. I have a nose hair on my nose coming out here. Yeah. I need a pumpkin. Ow. Almost got ow. Oh, got it. Oh, I hit that. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Here. Now we gotta put our mask on because this is the way of life now. Safety first, everybody. Me and you, me too. Enjoy this day, it's gonna be awesome. How are you two? Good, how are you? Great, great. What can we get for y'all today? I made these. And this. Oh, and that. Yeah, super talented. <laughs> I'm a handyman. Tell to visit your shop. Oh, visit my shop. Uh, it's on Etsy. It's called. Is it Logic Studio? No, that's Redbubble. Yeah, that's Redbubble. I don't know where your Etsy is. I forgot what my Etsy went. Um, I think it's Design Logic Studio. It's on Etsy. I think. I'll put a link somewhere. Um, and then visit my Redbubble shop too. That one's called Logic Studio. But for some reason, you can't search it up. So, if you see a picture of corgis taking a bath, like from the movie Spirit Away, that's from me. Support your boy, buy some stickers. Buy some something. It's a solo. Do you know what solo means? One person? Yeah, or alone in Spanish. Oh, really? Solo means like estoy solo, like I'm alone. <laughs> you know, playa is also a Spanish word. For player? No, playa, like the playa, the playa, like it's the beach. Oh, is that what that is? Yeah. Like when we were at the desert, over desert, the playa, that means beach in Spanish. You have some stuff on your face. It's like right on the other side. You got it. You got some stuff on your face. And it's almost 8 o'clock. <laughs> it's okay. Well, we got up at like 5, okay? And then I was still sleeping. The important thing is, I got up. All great adventures starts late. It is currently 9.35. It's only 9. Just gotta go stretch out my legs for a second and then we'll continue this journey. Yes. Hey, that's a companion bathroom. Do you think we could go together? Sure. 
Yeah. I'm driving. Even though it makes you nervous. Yeah. Yeah. It always makes me nervous. When somebody else is driving, that's not me. Hey, me too. <laughs> but I'm a safe driver. Are you? Yes. missed our exit. It's not my fault. <laughs> well, really. You were talking to me. Was I? <laughs> I feel like I wasn't even saying anything. Oh. I think you just weren't even paying attention. Let's see how long this tunnel is. Let's hold our breaths. <gasps> that wasn't bad. How do you know? You can hear me. I wasn't breathing. Let's play that back. Your mouth breather. <laughs> <laughs> I don't breathe in my mouth. You're a mouth breather. Uh-huh. You're a mouth snorer. Uh-huh. Earlier we saw a deer on the road. It was it was just standing like right on the side of the road. Like if you were just Oh look, there's a cow. It was just like right on the side of the road, like right here or something. It was cool. It was just standing there, looking sideways like this. You get the peak. What's that? No. Oh. I think cows. <laughs> I'm very impressed by cows and other animals that we see on the road. City boys. <laughs> <laughs> You're from the city too, it's hot. What are you doing? Why'd you turn this off? Because I got cold. Oh my goodness. That's hot. I'm gonna end my sentences when I talk to people like that. So, I was at the grocery store the other day and then I bought some milk and then, um, yeah. <laughs> you do that already. No, I don't. Okay, when I tell a story, according to my friends and my wife, it just ends. <laughs> You're like, oh, that's it? <laughs> it doesn't end up, bro. When I tell a story, they always say there's no points <laughs> yeah. to my story. To me, there is a point. I don't know what point I'm making, but there's one. But I never really end it either. It's yeah. just it just kind of trails off. And then <laughs> and then everybody just sits there, like, waiting in anticipation. <laughs> and then... <laughs> What's your point? <laughs> Whatever we're talking about in the moment, it reminded me of something, and then I tell the story. And then... And it's silent. <laughs> One of my friends says, Jimmy's stories leaves you wanting more. <laughs> You're being teased and then you never get the satisfaction. I think that's what he says. Do you think it's like that? Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> well, you do that too? Whoa. Let's go jumping off this bridge. Let's go swimming. We're switching again. <laughs> just stopped at another area. This is a beach town? Can we can we call it a beach town? Oh look there's a lighthouse. It's so windy over here. I'm trying to stop at an area to eat lunch but the wind is just blowing everything so now we're going back to the car. <laughs> maybe we'll park closer so that we can kind of look at the water or maybe we'll go somewhere else. We found another area to hit sit in our car safely from the wind mm. but enjoy this view strong wind oh man this car totally blocked it but there was like a nice view right here too what the hell is this car doing parking like an idiot man look at this wave over here there's somebody like standing over there they're just on the edge of the water maybe i'll go check out in a second after we eat lunch time oh. Can't even 
to the music up anyway. Yes, I did. Like it did. Yes, I did. <laughs> yes, I did. It's the wind that's windy. It's the wind that's <laughs> That was fun. It was it was painful but it was fun. <laughs> We're experiencing some technical hair oh. difficulty. It got so tangled. The wind and the sand was just doing a number on our faces. Good thing we were wearing a mask. That totally helped. And glasses. And glasses. Good thing I told you to I wear know. your glasses. <laughs> All right, on to the next uh, location. Made it to our destination. We're gonna head down to the little nat natural bridge. Natural bridge area, because it looks like you can kind of walk on it. So that's gonna be cool. Man, wasn't really expecting to hike, kind of not really dressed for it, but adventures out there, we have to go. This road trip has been quite adventurous. We've stopped at um, several different beaches and uh, well, it is called, like, the, scenic the scenic drive or whatever. This was pretty cool. At first I thought we were gonna go to like a spot somewhere or something, but you know how they say half of the adventure or half of the journey, wherever it is, it's the journey <laughs> you know that saying I'm like I'm butchering it but uh, something like that I don't know but you you probably get what I'm saying this whole trip feels like it was just one long journey it's been quite um, quite a journey now <laughs> It's been feel it's been quite fulfilling, you know, just cuz like everywhere we've gone so far, it's been like really nice. And even though the beach was like destroying our faces, it was still pretty cool. Went the wrong way. Now we got to backtrack. Well, I've never done this hike before. I wouldn't know which way to go either. Man, it's hot. Should have worn shorts. No, probably not because I just got like this spiky leaf stuck to my legs. Oh. And then I just found an ant crawling on my arm. <laughs> Alright. These shoes are not made for hiking. I'm gonna transition and then we'll be at the, the natural bridge through editing 
movie magic. All right, we made it. So this is our day. Life in our day, right? Yeah. A day in our life. Yes. Life in a day. Our day. <laughs> I'm just ruining this. So there's some questions that the movie should want us to answer. One of them is well, for me, I love my wife because we just recently got married. And I love my family. I mean, that's pretty common. I don't know. I just love being here in this moment with my wife. Um, what do you love? All of the above. <laughs> I love my husband. I love oh, my family. Funny to hear. Dear husband, I know. Still not used to it. But yes, the little adventures we take together, exploring our city and our state, I guess, in general. And I mean this, who wouldn't love this? That's very true. So what do you fear? Well, currently, heights. <laughs> um, that's about it right now. Can't really think of anything else. I'm afraid of a lot of things. Yes. But <laughs> She's kind of a worry ward, but... Yes. Comes with yeah. being an adult, though. That means that like I also get to enjoy things like this when I'm you know when you're worried about certain things and then you go out and you experience nature you know you kind of realize like oh I shouldn't worry about those things right now yeah you know just kind of enjoy the moment enjoy being alive that's good advice and then I think there's a couple more, but I only remember one. What would you change, like, about the world or yourself? <sighs> I mean, in the state of the world right now, there's, what, like, what wouldn't I change? There's so much, but I'm just one person, and I can only affect change in, like, a small portion. So, hopefully, what I can do through my community and people I know can affect the world on a bigger level. That's kind of, that's kind of my hopeful, yeah. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I mean, pretty much the same, just, you know, considering everything that's going on in the world right now. Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to say. That's good advice. All right. We're gonna end it here because this is a good spot to end all this stuff. Hope you guys enjoyed this. This has been a day in our life.
Peace. All right, that was our adventure. I hope you guys liked it. Like and subscribe for more content. Um, I think we're gonna start a new series since we've been doing it a lot already. Maybe I'll call it Pacific Northwest Adventures. Yeah, Pacific Northwest Adventures. Like and subscribe, tune in for the next adventure. Peace.